I haven't gone in that room until just now. Um, it'll take about five minutes to upload and whoever knows, I mean, well, I'm scared here. However long it takes for me to do this. Um, I went into the extra room. The house is ice fucking cold, okay? Within 10 seconds, 1001, 1002, exactly. The TV goes on, blasting loud. It was off and then up on a, like lots of those sounds. And do, do, it's a thriller horror movie without a doubt, but real um, strong sounds like that. I hope I'm making sense, I'm really terrified. And it just got louder and louder the whole time I was in there. I was in there for about close to three minutes. I immediately left that room. By the time I had left, all I could hear in that room was thriller horror movie. I came in here and I asked Jesus. I don't always get an answer. I'm just speaking to Jesus. I say, what the fuck is going on here? They're still in the house? Like, they're killing people around the clock here, dude. The agents flew by. I reviewed the videos. Unfortunately, it's really hard for me with a phone like this to capture fast moving, uh, whatever the word. But at least I got the time and it's there for a historical record that there was a, a there hasn't been any uh, air response or whatever they call that since this. Okay, what I couldn't talk about, I can, I, I, I'm glad I remembered. So when I was uploading and I said that thing I said about, can't talk about, block, the block, a terrorist had gone into the dark backyard of the yellow house. I have enough common sense with what I just witnessed in here to not be sticking my head out and trying to see them moving around in the pitch black, dark in their backyards. They're making quite a bit of noise and they do that. They. I don't need to tell the special ops or the agents who surveyed these terrorists this sort of thing. So they did that. Um, for about a good three minutes, they were... No, I would say two. Well, anyways, short amount of time. They were in the dark backyard. Then I couldn't hear them, and I heard another person get fucking laid out. The way they're laying them out here these days is not regular murders like I used to witness here. They're just straight up using some sort of weapon on these people and they're going fast down. I'm scared and I look horrible. I don't like to do these face things. I can hardly speak the English language anymore. Okay, I'm really scared. So there was a terrorist in the yard and then within a few minutes they took, okay, you know how I always take a picture of the corner of my room where the, I just can't do this right now and film at the same time. On the side of the yellow house, up either on floor three or in the yellow house, I don't know where it could have been. The second floor of the yellow house or the first floor of the yellow house they dropped another one they killed another one and then after that within five minutes there was another one there's only been two that i can say i have heard agent helicopters it got really scary i mean i felt it it's all i can say and i knew that there was military flying and my guidance was, whatever you do, don't fucking talk about any of this right now, my God. 
with what happened at the yellow house, the body dropping and the one in the backyard. Now I can, and I, I'm glad I am. And then I just go in there and there's still a fucking terrorist in here with their TVs, okay? Um, and then I come in here and I just ask Jesus and I wish he could tell me. I wish he could tell me, but we know that he can't tell me that. It takes military and police to tell me that. And I said, what the fuck is going on here, man? Right now, there is a terrorist upstairs. Turn in the TV up, folks. Bye.